With remote work and cloud architectures becoming the norm, companies large and small are looking for alternatives to VPNs. Brittle, unperforming, and unsecure, this remote access technology has outlived its purpose. You have several VPNs alternatives to choose from, but many hide similar weaknesses beneath modern technologies. Hi, my name is Paul Andre de Vera, the head of growth at Twingate, and today I will help you understand VPN security and performance challenges and some VPN alternatives to consider. I will also explain why zero trust network access is the best way to replace your VPN system. As computers entered mainstream business use, security frameworks aligned with physical infrastructure. Central computing resources were big, static, and company-owned. Our employees could access these resources through managed desktop computers attached to office networks. Like a castle's wall, a security perimeter kept threats outside the networks while letting trusted employees work freely. Over time, portable computers gave employees the ability to work while traveling, but that required a way through the defensive walls. Virtual private network technologies originally linked remote offices to corporate data centers over the internet. VPN became a secure remote access solution by adapting the model to let remote users through the secure perimeter. Connecting and authenticating with a VPN gateway makes user devices extensions of the protected network. Things have changed over the past 30 years. A company's resources are not confined to a central on-prem data center. Business applications are hosted in the cloud or sourced from X-as-a-service providers. Companies now rely on a mix of employees, contractors, and other third parties. As a result, resources are being accessed from more diverse population of devices that are not under the company's direct control. These changes were well underway when pandemic turned network traffic inside out. Before, most traffic originated on the company network and only a few employees needed remote access. Suddenly, everyone was working remotely, often from their personal devices and hitting the VPN gateway. People have known about VPN weaknesses for a long time now, but most organizations thought they can get, take their time migrating to something else. Now, everyone recognizes VPN's growing limitations. VPN undermines network security. To let remote users connect, VPN gateways publish their presence on the internet. This makes every corporate gateway visible to anyone running a simple scanning for applications. Hackers can discover information about the VPN gateway just as easily. One unpatched VPN appliance is enough to expose the network. Designed to link managed networks, VPNs trust any authenticated connection. An exploit or stolen credential lets hackers access the protected network as if it was their trusted users. Once through the VPN gateway, they can use this network's own tools to move laterally, escalate privileges, and expand their foothold. VPN's challenges are acutely felt with privileged users. Their credentials are the keys to the kingdom for cyber criminals. A compromised privilege access gives them the power to make system level changes, granted escalated privileges, and worse. VPN only provides remote network access and does nothing else to keep privileged accounts secure. Increasingly, the hub and spoke technology of VPN systems adds to network performance issues. VPN gateways concentrate all remote traffic through the private networks even when the final destination is a cloud service. Data running through the user also passes through the gateway. Adding to the problem, VPN clients defaults to an all or nothing setting that routes all user traffic through the gateway. Video conferencing and other applications that could securely pass over to the internet instead stream back and forth to the private network. Finally, VPN gateways become a choke point when accessed too many times through remote users. They can only support a certain number of concurrent VPN connections before rationing bandwidth. These issues were manageable when a fraction of the workplace needed remote access. Now, bandwidth pressures rising latency worsens the user experience, both on-prem and remote. VPN forces organizations to manage a fragmented access control infrastructure. An enterprise VPN solution only grants access to a company's private network. Each cloud platform and third-party service has its own VPN solution. Managing consistent security and access policies across multiple systems is challenging. Any misconfiguration could open a vulnerability that hackers could exploit.
several solutions compete as remote access alternatives to VPN. Most of them, however, use modern technologies to create the same challenges. Microsoft's Remote Desktop Protocol, RDP, and other virtual desktop technologies give users the in-office experience while working from home. These solutions act like extreme services, sending the desktop operating systems monitor output to the user's device. A client app sends the user's keyboard and mouse inputs back to the RDP server. This approach ensures that sensitive data never leaves the company. However, RDP and similar technologies share VPN weaknesses. Users connect through publicly visible gateways that are vulnerable to exploits as VPN gateways. One leg of the round trip may have been eliminated, but traffic from cloud resources still burdens the private network. Software-defined wide area networks are an evolution of VPN's original purpose. These cloud-native solutions rely on software-defined networks to link an organization's various locations together. SD1 vendors offer two options for extending their solutions to manage remote access. The first is simply a VPN service with all the associated weaknesses, and the other is approach requires deploying an SD1 appliance to the remote user's location. The appliance offers better security on home networks and can provide better redundancy with LTE wireless networks. This approach, however, can be expensive and only works in a fixed location. Secure Access Service Edge is a Gartner-developed framework for enterprise networking. SACE is a way to develop decentralized cloud-based architectures. Remote access will be a part of the design, but SACE encompasses much more. SACE is a work in progress as many of the component technologies are still being developed. The complexity and scope of such a large shift in architecture often limit SACE solutions to large enterprises with significant resources. Fortunately, the access control component of SACE, Zero Trust Network, ZTNA, is fully accessible to companies at any scale. Zero Trust Network Access is a modern security framework that eliminates the weaknesses of legacy secure perimeters approaches like a VPN. ZTNA unifies access control for all users and all resources, no matter their location, by building a framework based on three concepts. First, assume the security breaches are always present. Attack surfaces have grown dramatically since the days of the secure perimeter. Social engineering attacks, stolen credentials, and exploits can give hackers instant access to a protected network. ZTNA assumes that any network device, credential, user, or resource could already be compromised. Second, explicitly verify every attempt to access a protected resource. As in the name implies, zero trust does not assume anything can be trusted. Instead, trust must be earned through identity verification and careful evaluation of the device posture, connection source, and other contextual factors. Third, only grant the degree of access users needed in each session. This principle of least privilege requires granular role-based access rules. Unlike the permissive access of a VPN gateway, ZTNA grants users enough access to get the job done and no more. Combined, these three principles drive a new approach to securing access to an organization's assets. Unlike a VPN which allows access to any resource on the network, Zero Trust only grants access to specific resources based on a user's role. Granular access controls based on principles of least privilege prevents hackers from moving laterally through a compromised network. Explicit verification further mitigates cyber attacks. Hackers may compromise the user's account, but identity is only one of the criteria ZTNA systems use during authentication. Device posture checks, for example, can also recognize a compromised user's device and block access. Cloud-native ZTNA solutions avoid the performance bottlenecks that VPN technologies create. Direct connections between the users and the resources relieve the bandwidth pressure on private networks. The user experience also improves with more performant routing. TwinGate's implementation of Zero Trust adds more security and performance benefits over legacy VPN technologies. Our solution creates software-defined perimeters around protected assets. Administrators can create micro-segmented network architectures that protect on-prem and cloud resources within the same system. Granular access controls rules are enforced on the user devices before making any connections. Access to protected resources happens only when all identity verifications of device posture and other checks are complete. 
Connections between user devices and protected resources pass through direct encrypted tunnels along with the most performant routes. Proxy apps on user devices and in front of resources allow traffic to pass back and forth securely. Unlike VPN gateways, TwinGate solution does not broadcast its presence. On-prem resources disappear from the private network and cloud resources disappear from the public internet. The scanning tools that hackers use to target VPN vulnerabilities have nothing to see so your attack surface shrinks dramatically. By replacing VPN's hub and spoke topology with direct tunnels, TwinGate makes private networks more performant. User traffic destined for cloud resources never hits the private network. They don't no longer round trips on the company infrastructure. There's no more gateway-driven congestion. Replacing VPN with TwinGate's remote access solution alleviates bandwidth pressure and managed networks. Direct tunnels between resources and devices also improve the user experience. Eliminating the round trip imposed by VPN gateways reduces latency. TwinGate's client apps also uses split tunneling by default. Video conferencing, web browsing, and other use cases do not need extra encryption simply pass over the public internet to give users a better experience. Granular access control make privilege access management easier. TwinGate's access rules apply for both on-prem and remote network access. Unlike the VPN's all-or-nothing approach, you can limit privilege accesses to specific resources. TwinGate also adds MFA and other security features like SSH and other tools to keep them out of the wrong hands. Managing secure access is much easier with TwinGate than with legacy VPN systems. Our software solution works with your CI CD pipelines so you can deploy, maintain, and release TwinGate proxies programmatically. You no longer need to juggle separate VPN policies for the private networks of each cloud platform. Instead, deploying TwinGate in front of every on prem and cloud resources lets you manage access within a single system. Administrative consoles simplify onboarding, offboarding, and changing user permissions. Migrating from your existing VPN systems to TwinGate's ZTNA solution is not an all or nothing proposition. TwinGate coexists with your existing network infrastructure. Starting with the teams that benefit the most, you can implement zero trust in phases. Rolling out TwinGate over time lets you build upon earlier successes without disrupting your business operations. VPN technologies were developed when the idea of secure perimeter meant something. They create a portal through a private network's defenses so a few remote users can access centralized information resources. That framework no longer works in today's decentralized, cloud-enabled ecosystem. Resources and users can be anywhere. Access can be through public and private networks. More people use personal devices to access company resources, and users may not be employees, yet they still need access. Increasingly, VPN makes remote access expensive and difficult to manage. It creates bottlenecks that make networks less performant and interfere with user productivity. Most importantly, VPN itself becomes a significant attack vector for today's sophisticated cyber criminals. Other technologies from virtual desktops to secure access, service edge, try to replace VPN. These alternatives, however, even suffer weaknesses similar to VPN or require an expensive changes to an entire enterprise network infrastructure. TwinGate implements zero trust network access to create a modern approach to security and access control. Software defined perimeters and least privileged access policies will shrink your attack surface dramatically. At the same time, encrypted tunnels passing directly between user devices and protected resources improve performance dramatically. Phase deployments and compatibility with your CI CD pipelines and security stack, as well as simple administrative tools, take the risk out of replacing your VPN system with a more secure performance twin gate solution. Use our free starter plan to get TwinGate remote access working for yourself or a small team. Then contact us to learn how easily replacing your VPN system can be. Till next time, I'll see you later, Gator.